welcome to the MV Marco Polo. I'm aboard this ship for the next five weeks uh, lecturing on photography as we voyage uh, from Europe over to Canada and then uh, back home here. I'm uh, one of the first people to, to board the ship today and my room isn't even ready yet so uh, I thought just a quick chance to uh, do a short video. I'm going to go off in a moment and take some photos around the vessel to show you where I'm staying. I'm going to try and post uh, one or two of these videos uh, throughout the, the voyage. Whether I'll manage it, I don't know. I've got limited internet access, so it may turn out to be that they don't get posted till I get home. Well, we'll see. Really looking forward to the voyage. Come with me now as I show you around the ship. had a, a good look round the, uh, the ship now. I've had some lunch and I finally made it to my cabin along with, you can see, all the luggage. Uh, it's a really nice cabin and there's a, a few treats here uh, because this is a very special voyage. Uh, first of all, in addition to our the normal sort of programme for what's happening today, excursion lists, etc., there's um, a rather nice uh, journal I suppose which says Marco Polo celebrating 50 years uh, complete with pen really nice and also a couple of um, little badgers pins also celebrating 50 years of the Marco Polo so I guess uh, I ought to be wearing uh, one of these on my waistcoat when I'm giving my lectures so that's um, the gifts and the freebies uh, let me just show you around the cabin so as we enter the cabin we can see there's two two beds and above the uh, the one on the right uh, there's a fold down um, uh, bed so it can sleep three two portals uh, looking out the um, uh, the other bed appears to have been claimed already by a certain traveling bear the usual set of freebies of course we've got life jackets and lifeboat drill will be in a short while looking the other way we've got a television the entrance into the um, uh, the cabin over on the left here is a three door wardrobe uh, rather large with some space safe inside and plenty of hanging space full length wardrobe on there what I will find quite useful is over this side which is the uh, uh, well it's a, it's a dressing table rather than a desk but um, uh, probably not much space for the knees but at least it's a working space where I can set the laptop up uh, to do any additional work. So that's the cabin. All that remains for me to do now is to uh, unpack all the luggage, claim the bed back off the bear and uh, edit my photos and uh, video and hopefully get this posted sometime before I return from Canada. So thanks for watching and look out for hopefully some more travel logs uh, uh, during uh, this five-week voyage. Thank you. Bye-bye. <laughs>